impact here in a short period of time? What's the emotions right now? Uh, just disappointed. You know, wanted to come in there and get the win. Uh, so that's really just the emotion. Just disappointed we didn't come out uh, with the outcome we worked so hard for. Um, you know, definitely something that you know we need to learn from and then move on. Jalen Warren took the uh, ball for the pitch. You said he thought he might have been a little bit deep on it. Uh, was that the case? Or you just no. No, 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 I gotta get the, the Jalen's fine. I gotta get him the ball. Um, I think I stepped on a little bit. I gotta look at my footwork and see what happened. Um, but the pitch has to be out front, and, and you know, definitely a lot more catch balls on something. Kenny, were you trying to throw the last one away on the sideline? Uh, that that was yeah. I was I wanted it higher than that. Definitely, either Pat was gonna get it or it was gonna be out of bounds. Um, I didn't put it high enough. You know, we I cannot throw an interception there um, in that point of the game. Um, Obviously, we're moving the ball well. I want to be aggressive, but at the same time, uh, the clock was our friend there, and I wanted to, you know, possess the ball and, and not do that in good field position. So I can't uh, make that mistake. The when results, what matters, but at the same time, being out there, getting those couple of touchdowns, and take through the emotions that you felt when you scored those. Uh, yeah, I know, guys. The, you know, a lot of emotions, but I, you know, the only thing I'm thinking about is winning out there. So I was just kind of, you know, staying in tune with the game and what we needed to do uh, to come out with the win. And uh, you know, that didn't happen. So something that I definitely need to learn from quickly um, and get it fixed for whatever my next opportunity may come. Can you surprise any, any inclination that you possibly could be going into this game if things weren't going well? No, no, I was never told that. Um, just coach came in at halftime and said I was going. So just kind of, uh, you know, put all the preparation I prepared like the start. Um, you know, I spent a lot of time in the facility getting ready, so uh, I felt, felt pretty good while I was in there. Kenny, what has your know, preparation been like in the last couple of weeks? What has your preparation process been like these last couple of weeks? Like on the starter minus the reps. So it's just, uh, you know, you don't get a lot of reps, but that's why I have to be really tuned in mentally, go through every single read that Mitch was getting in practice, in game, uh, watch the film as if I'm the one playing, um, just so I can be prepared if my opportunity did come, which it did today. Um, so definitely, you know, a great, you know, learning process that I was being able to be a part of to help, uh, you know, prepare me per se. Kenny, you know the fans have been behind you since draft day, but still to hear your reaction, what did you think of that? Yeah, it was great. You know, the fans are fans are passionate. They want to win, and, and you know, no one wants to win more than us. So we put a lot of work in. We have to come out with a win there. Um, you know, something that we need to learn from, like I said, quickly and, and get back on track. Kenny, what about the reaction for you personally? The reaction to you personally when you went in? Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's great. It's all, I really appreciate you know all the support. Um, but like I said, I mean, I got to go play a game. So it's definitely, I didn't spend too much time on it. Um, you know, I thought that, you know, we, we picked it up in the second half there and had the ball moving, but the turnovers killed us and that's on me. So I got to get that get that right um, quickly. Okay, what have you been told and what do you expect for next week? I haven't been told anything. You know, we just lost, didn't have a chance to talk to anybody. So. You didn't get a lot of. He made the switch to you because he wanted to give the team the spark. Well, you gave him the spark. And could you sense that? Um, I don't know. I mean, I just played with an edge. I, I, I think that that was something. You know, you know, I wanted to bring to the table. Um, I do not like to lose. This is not a good feeling. Uh, I don't want it to be a familiar feeling. So I definitely want to get back out there and, and get a victory. Um, you know, and get us back on track. So I, I think you know, it's a little bit of an edge to me. Um, I, I want that to rub off on everybody. I want us to be, you know, have an attitude with us out there on the field. So uh, I'm excited to get back to work and uh, get us back on track. Kenny, you didn't get a lot of reps with Pickens in the preseason. What can you say about the chemistry you two showed on the field today? Yeah, I mean, any rep I could steal with George, I try to get one on the side or, you know, Deontay, any, any of the guys. Um, you know, the ones I really never really got a chance to do a lot with. Um, anything that I could get, I would try to steal on the side or uh, the, the couple reps I'd get to do. I really want to take advantage of those and treat those like game reps so, you know, when the time came, I'd be ready. Um, so I think all that, you know, definitely paid off with some of the timing stuff that we were doing. Obviously, Mitch was disappointed to, you know, for the switch to happen, but what was the dynamic like with him on the sideline in that second half? Yeah, yeah, he was great. Communication was great. Um, just trying to help me out, just the way you know I was helping him out. Um, you know, he, he's a great guy, and um, you know, definitely you know glad that he's on our team and I have him as a teammate. Did you, Did you feel like the whole offense was on the table, whole game plan when you came in? Yeah, I mean, I, I everything told, was available. Yeah, to you. I, I told Co. I mean, I was I was prepared. I knew every call in, in the plan. I told him don't don't change up um, just because I'm in there. Like you know, let's let it rip and, and see what happens. Um, so I was prepared. Um, definitely didn't want to handcuff us in any situation. I want a coach to call the game. He called a great game. Um, like I said, the plays were there and we made plays, but the turnovers killed us. So it's definitely on me and uh, I have to improve. Yeah, there, there was, was a play. first ball too, Kenny, or how did you feel about the first ball that played the best? Oh, yeah. Listen, I mean, I told those guys if they're one on one, I'm going to give them a chance. Um, you know, we all feel really good about that receiver room. 
and how talented every guy in there is. Um, you know, Chase on the safety, I'm, I'm going to take that and, and give him a chance. The ball, sometimes the ball doesn't bounce your way. That time it did it. Um, I get that, but you know, he said he's going to go get it. I told him I'm going to throw him more passes, so I'm not gun shy um, to throw down the field to him at all. So um, definitely want to work the continuity, um, you know, as soon as possible. Kenny, there was a play where I think you approached the line, looked like you were talking to the guys, and then you hit Pickens on the, on the left sideline in the third quarter. Was that a hot route or a full audible? What was that? Um, no, I just wanted to get the protection right, um, so I had time to get it off. Um, I knew where I wanted to go. I knew I had George one-on-one. -on -one. Um, I wanted to slide the line left. I would drift a little bit. Jalen would come across and pick up the man on the line of scrimmage, um, and I knew I'd have enough time to get it off. You know, it's a, it's a fade, three-step. I'll get it up and down. Um, definitely a good play that got us in the position we wanted to be. Um, didn't, you know, the outcome wasn't what we wanted. Passed down, down, the the pass down the middle to Fryer but when the, the big guy was right on your, in your face. Can you talk about that play? Yeah, I mean, listen, third down, um, you know, 88 does a great job. It kind of, you know, it was a little similar to the Jacksonville play, I felt like, in preseason. Um, you know, I trusted him he was going to be where he was, and, uh, you know, he ran a great route. I wanted to give him a chance, and, uh, you know, our line did a great job, I thought, all day. Um, like that group has improved tremendously. Uh, I think they're definitely the strength of our offense right now, and we're kind of taking their lead. How tough is it to stand in there when that guy is bearing down? It's not tough, man. It's in the job description. It is what it is. Um, and I'm, I'm a quarterback, and that, that's that's in my job. So I know I tell those guys I'll stand in there. I don't, I don't I really don't care. Uh, I know they'll get it right. Uh, my job is to stand in there and make throws. Okay, but did you mean zero coverage um, on the sideline ball to Pickens on the last possession? I think it was third down. Sideline ball to Pickens. One on one down the left sideline. The one that we just talked about earlier, when I changed the protection? I didn't think you changed it there, but I, I, I might be Yeah, I mean, I, I knew I was getting pressure. I thought it was one high. I got to look at it again, but I, I felt like it was one high, and they were, um, you know, bringing a lot of pressure. I had press in the slot. Um, you know, I love George in that one-on-one -on -one situation, um, so I just wanted to give him an opportunity. Kenny had two rushing touchdowns, and you picked up the big first down on the scramble. How do you feel like you're confident in your ability to affect the game running the ball at this level? Yeah, I am. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to, you know, rip off 60-yard runs, but that's something I think that if they're going to drop underneath a lot of things and give me some running lanes, I can definitely use my, my legs and, um, you know, get first downs. And the red zone just adds another element. Um, you know, that was a play we had dialed up, I think, more towards the middle of the field. Um, but, you know, when we asked about, you know, when we get down there, you know, what kind of plays I like, I put that one up first because I can either throw in a pattern or I can take it off and run. It kind of was a three-way go I give it a notch. So, I mean, there was plenty of options. I like to have options down there and definitely use my athleticism as one of them. Kenny, what do you think you're able to prove to your teammates and how important is it to get that, that first opportunity kind of behind you here? Um, I mean, like, like I said, I, I wanted to win, um, you know, more than anything. So I, I don't know what I proved uh, to anybody about it. You know, we didn't win, so that's one thing we didn't do. So that, that's really my only focus. Anyone else? All right. Cam.